anybody hear that noise in the background? It's Call of Duty 3. I mean, Call of Duty Black Ops 3. Cool game, right? Well, I wouldn't know. The fucking servers aren't working. And this is pissing me off. Okay. I know that this is an overreacting fucking video, but come on, Activision. You know this game was gonna be big. It's Black Ops 3. We've had one, we've had two, we have three now, and we all saw what was gonna be coming to this game. Of course, we all went and bought it on day one and overloaded the damn servers on the PC, but there's no excuse for it, Activision. You take millions of dollars from us, well, not millions, but you take all this money from us, and you don't fucking do anything with it with servers. This pisses me off when I see this happen, Activision. You know what? I wouldn't be so mad if this was a console release, because at least with the console releases, you can get on a local multiplayer and play by yourself. But this is PC. PCs are DRMs, and if you lose your internet connection, this game that costs 80 fucking dollars doesn't fucking work. This is bullshit, Activision. Absolute bullshit. This game is having nothing but problems right now on PC, and guess what? You don't fucking care, because we just give you some more of this, and a little bit more of this, every fucking time, Activision, and you basically take us for granted. You guys are turning into the new Capcom. That's fucking bullshit. This game needs to get fixed. It needs to get fixed right away, because every time I restart a new game, bang, out of game. Internet connection was lost. Restart it. Got it back in. Next, it's lost again. What point of you guys at Activision are gonna pick fix this fucking server issue? And you say every fucking time, oh, we're so, <coughs> <coughs> oh, we're sorry, it won't happen again. Guess what? It happened with Black Ops 2. It happened with Ghost. It happened with Advanced Warfare. Want to go to fucking end, Activision? I am so sick and tired of this shit happening every fucking time. You know what? I'm to the point where I'm not gonna buy these games on day one release. Because this bullshit happens every fucking time. Guys, I don't know. I know I've been yelling a lot, but I paid $80 for a fucking broken game. Doesn't that piss you off or does that just piss me off? Let me know.